Don't fall through this. No! Oh, you bloody ass wiping re. Oh, there are so many words I want to say right now that's really fed me off. Ah, welcome back to Brew Pub Simulator! This is Hybrid Still. And for the fifth or sixth time or whatever time I've been doing this, I had to start again, 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 because. Oh, how is this. I don't even understand what's happened here. Apparently, I'm brewing two beers even though I only brewed one. But there we go. So, technically, I've got two beers here. I'm going to see if I'm actually going to finish both of those. If I can, then we may be able to we may be able to solve one of the problems I was going to have. Like, not enough beer. Not enough time. But it's all good. Anyway, so, we got a brand spanking new email through the, uh, through the post, so to speak. And it is from my old buddy. And I think this is where I left it off from the last video. I had to trawl through the whole game in one day just to get to this point again. So, I've got to make a West Coast IPA with enhanced citrus aromas. Oh, joys. All right, so I think we've only got to do five litres, which is all right. Let's have a look. we got to do... Ah, three litres. Excellent. Fantastic. Now, what do I need to do to have this hot fest? West Coast IPA. I need Amarillo Simcoe Magnum Citra. Grand. Excellent. Okay, so let's just buy every type of hop. So, supplies. So, Amarillo... I'm probably going to need a bag of those. Citra, Magnum, and Simcoe. Excellent. And I'm probably going to need another one of those. So we'll order all that and be done. Hey! So yeah, I have been um, busy. Basically, because the update went through and it made my game a little bit unstable, I read through their notes and they basically said, Hey, if you, I mean, if you're going to update the game, you might have to restart the game because then it will fix all the problems. And I was having this problem where on the floor I had this big lighted circle and it get flickering. Like the whole time I was like, well that's not good. So I had to basically restart again, 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 basically. Which sucks. So, what I need to do is I need to make this brand spanking new tropical beer. Which is going to be amazing, I think. I think if I can get this one on like a permanent basis of being made, then we might be looking at a brand spanking new beer that I might just go, hey, I'm just going to adopt this and be good. All right, so that's Magnum, and that is uh, Simcoe, and that is my packet of yeast. Excellent. Now I do have all beer. I have all beer of yeast. Do I need a different yeast on this? I don't even know. Hold on. Let's just bookmark the recipe, shall we? And then we can look through. Oh no, yeah, all beers, ale beers. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. Right here we go. Five liters. Pin recipe. Fantastic. Let's do this. So we need five point three liters. 5.4 will be just fine. Excellent. Next, uh, place the pot on the stove. Yep. Add 160 litres of light malt extract. So 160 grams. Or 1,300. So 500, 1,500. So that's the whole tin. Lob that in the bin. Excellent. And now we just need to add another 100 mil. Ta da. All right, cool. Next, add 14 grams of Magnum Hop. Oh, I do have Magnum Hop. Fantastic. All right, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 13, 14. Cool, cool, cool. So what am I doing with all these other hops? Then? Uh, turn on the stove for 60 minutes. 60 seconds later. All right. Then what? Oh, I've got to add all the... Oh, okay. I've got to add the Amarillo, Simcoe, Citra, and the yeast after boil. Ah, oh, that explains a lot. See, that's why they've that, that's why there's written instructions in this game. Follow the instructions, and all will be good. And there we go. Right, 60 minutes on the yeoldy boil. That's good. Okay, so we need to bring that. Wait until this gets down to 21 degrees, then add 15 grams of Amarillo. That's Magnum. Amarillo. So we need 15 grams of this. So 10, 5. Let me just pop that on the shelf. Okay. Uh, 15 grams of Simcoe. 5, 10. Fantastic. Uh, 5 grams of Citra. That tropical punch. And five grams of yeast. Yeast! And there we have it. So then we have to transfer mixture. Oh, oh hold on. 
need me another bucket. Right, now we need to move this into here. It'd be right with seven litres worth of money. It'd be fine with that. Fantastic. So I've got two beers on the floor, which is amazing. And then I've got like this over here. So I made this one because I was like, I need beer. And whilst I'm playing through the game, I was like, I need beer. So I, I was just making bog standard APA until the cows came home, which is what this is. This is like a, whilst you progress through this game, the best thing you can do is just have money. And the only way to get money cheap is to just make APAs. Literally, just put, just get your big pot, double up on the recipe, and just do it. It'll last you a night, at least. As long as you've got, like, four or five seats. I mean, after that, it gets a bit hairy. But apart from that, we're all good. So, yeah, let's, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to serve a load of people. Now, the difference between me serving a load of people and me bothering with this game is that what I'm doing is I'm literally just living on one, like, beer. That's the only one I'm living on. $6.32, and that's it. So I'm literally just making one beer over and over again, constantly. And if it hits a five star, it's all good. I can charge $6.30 for it and be happy. Unless the person who's buying it off me isn't happy at all. Then I'm just going to shut the bar. Hey lady, would you like a number one? You would. Oh, she's happy. It's all good. Hi sir, that's a sharp dressed jacket. How you doing? $6.32, $2.55 in tips. We're going to have money. I can upgrade my kitchen after this. When I say upgrade, I want to order it. I want to make things look like they're all in uniform and be nice. How's that beer treating you? Oh, yeah. Sir, that's a fetching shirt. How are you doing? Brilliant. Have a grand evening. You look like you're about ready to go out there and kill the competition with your good looks and handsomeness. And this is what I've been doing. Literally, I've just been getting through all the missions as quickly as I can. <laughs> And just bombing it and just making one beer over and over again and just serving when I need it. Because when you need it, you need it. You want a beer? Have a beer. It's the warm one that's been left on the side. It's lovely. Hasn't got any flies in it whatsoever. Oh, whoa. The sweetest thing. Hey, would you like another one, sir? Another one for the road. Just don't drink and drive. I, I really wish people wouldn't do it. Have another one, sir. Yeah, you know you like it. Maybe I should start asking, instead of waiting, for, instead of just serving them straight away, I think this has been part of my problem. I'm serving people like really, really fast before they've even spoken. I don't think they like it. I really don't think they like it at all. <laughs> yes, sir. Hi, you would like, oh, I haven't got one. Bye. I don't have tropical beers. I'm really sorry. Bye-bye. Yeah, you get, oh, oh, annoyed that there's no food. Urgh. Yeah, it's because I haven't got a cook yet. Yes, madam, what can I do for you? You want a beer? Have a beer. Oh yeah, this dishwasher, by the way, is the best thing in the game. Now, you can sit here and protest as much as you like, but I genuinely feel that the di the actual glass washer, this, is absolutely fantastic. The reason why I call it a dishwasher, uh, a glass washer, is because I haven't got any dishes. So what's the point of calling it a dishwasher if it's just washing glasses? I know, I'm being, I'm being gittish about it. I'm being me, sir, for a third time. Oh, you grace me with your money. Thank you very much, sir. Most appreciated. Have a great evening. I see, 13 litres of beer. Doing all right. Number one. Fine. Have a great evening. Let me just clean your table for you. Thank you. It's the least I can do for the lovely people who are paying my wages. Have a, have a great evening, guys. You know, I know it's not exactly the best place in the world right now, but this bar will become better because of you. Yes, sir. Just give you any beer. Have the warm one. Excellent. The one that's been out of the tap with little flies dancing around its top. Yes. Ah. Thank you very much, madam. Yes, madam. What can I do? Any beer? Have that one. Lovely beer. Ah. Oh, it's so good. Right, we've got two and a half minutes left. Or two and a half hours left in, if you think about it in game time. 
So we should, I think we're going to be serving about eight more beers. Because I've, I've, I've been doing this with just four customers the whole time. And the reason why is because if you watch my last video, I was like losing it by the end of it. I had like all those people in here with like the horse heads on and they were just, there was too many of them. I couldn't cope. My brain just wouldn't live with it. So I've sort of, I've been, what I've been sort of cutting my own neck on it a little bit. Did this not what? Hi right, sir, any beer? That beer. Have a good beer. Have you finished? Have you finished? Yes, you have. Congratulations. <laughs> sir, that is a wonderful shirt. How are you doing? Have a beer. It's a lovely beer. Yes, it's a nice beer. I'm not... Look, I can't do anything about the food problem here. We haven't got any. Not my fault. Food is coming, my friends. Food is coming. Please come back another day when... Ah, oh, I just broke a glass. I'm hoping that someone else is going to be, like, ordering a beer. Because this one's just sitting here now. Excuse me, sir. Would you like another beer? I'll sell it to you half price. It's been sitting here for a little while. Would you like the, this beer? Oh, yes, you would. Have a great day. Just get, Yeah, you got yourself a beer. Last customer. I think this is going to be it. I think it's the man in the toilet. I tried to go in there. Like, as the door opens, like, when the customers are going in, I tried to follow. You can't follow them in there. It's not It's not good. Have a great day. I think you are my last two customers, so I will wait your table. You don't have to talk to me. I'm just still going to be standing here. You guys are absolutely boring. You suck, both of you. Why are you still here? This is a weird bug. Cleaning the empty space above a table. Hey, we got up to level five. Now it does look like I lost a load of money, but I have just bought like loads of stuff. So we made the APA, that's a good one. I'm just gonna call this Homeless Mike because if you watched my previous video, I said if you wanted your name in a beer, let me know. We've got another American Pale. This is gonna be Artemis. Congratulations for getting your names in the game. Oh yeah, see? I stand by my word. If I say I'm gonna do something, I I'm gonna do it. Thank you very much for subscribing to the channel. Like I said, if anybody does actually want their name in the in the game whilst I'm playing it, more than happy to have it. But it was on that one specific video. If you can find that video and put your name down for it, it's all good. Go check it out. I'll leave a link in the description box below to that one. Go and watch it and see what you think. Anyways, so we're 33% done into that one, which sucks. Right, I'm going to put this up on a shelf for now. Same with this one. Where did the beer go? Homeless Mike's disappeared. Ah, oh, bloody game. Like I've lost a, I've lost an entire crate of beer. I better put it in a keg before it disappears completely. Well, Artemis, you did survive. Congratulations. Welcome to the uh, welcome to the oasis. So this tropical beer. Well, I've made I've made one or two of these already. We I did it a little bit cheeky, where you can make this beer in nine minutes. It, it's well nine seconds according to the game, but it's it's quite cheeky way of doing it. But you can, um, yeah, you can really uh, you can. You make a lot of money with it. When it's finished, I'll show you. Right, I'm gonna skip. Actually, I'm not gonna skip a day. I'm gonna I'm gonna deck my kitchen out. So, I want I need to turn this into. Oh, hello. Oh, you're empty. That's why. Right. Oh, I haven't unlocked it yet. Oh no. Yeah. No. No, I haven't. Wow. Because I'm after these these half shelves. I think they unlock at like level five. We're literally just about to cross that level. And my ratings for my bar. I wanted a beer and I got a beer. I was hungry and the kitchen was closed. That's because I haven't got a cook yet. Let me just skip forward two days and we'll go from there. Or actually, I should I should serve beer. I love the smell of beer in the morning. You know what? I'll finish this day off. We'll come back to this when I'm done. Oh, I'm back. All right, there we go. The West Coast IPA is ready. The IBU of 73.3. It's a 7 SRM and it's a five star. And it's this icon here, which is a fancy beer. So if you can make this beer each time, I mean, the markup on this is ridiculous. Like bog standard price, 786. You could, you might, you could charge 1080 for this and be happy. So I'm looking at doing around 780 for this. I'm going to call this the Tropico. Uh, Tropico. And I can just buy a keg of it and be happy, but you know what? I, I'm going to get rid of this for obviously the mission. But the idea is now I can actually make something that's got a bit more of a kick to it and a bit more of a. We can make a lot more money from it, which is the plus side. We need to make more money. And if we can make more money on everything else, we're, we're all good. All right, let's get all these out of here. So thanks to Artemis for putting their name up against the. Uh, in the late in the video that that beer sold out which is good homeless mike unfortunately i lost your beer it, it just disappeared into the ether i'm not even sure where it went but apparently um well I'll, I'll find it at some other point i don't know maybe we'll see how things go 
Oh, you got to be joking. I just lost a beer keg through the scenery as well. Where do things keep going? Right, I need to get everything off the floor. And the only way to do that is to buy some racking. I can't buy racking, I need these. All right, so I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to like do some more stuff, I think. Okay, well that sucks. I need to buy some, I need to buy some more locker stuff. I wanna get some shelving around here. I wanna do stuff properly, so we're gonna have to do that again. Um, where did I put my, is this the one? It is the one, fantastic. We'll take this. Don't disappear into the floor. It's got, oh my God. My keg disappeared. Hold on. Holy crap, I can't put anything on the floor. Um. Don't fall through the scenery. Don't fall through this. No! Oh, you bloody ass wiping re. Oh, there are so many words I want to say right now that's really fed me off. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I want to kill somebody now. Oh my god. Okay, so we've loaded up the game. I need to clean up my desk. Oh, on my floor. Put the table back where I got it from. And there we go. So I've lost some glasses as well. So I've only got six glasses left. We're done here. <laughs> it disappeared again. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? Oh my god. Right, if I put it there. Oh good, it hasn't gone. Right, okay. No way. Right, we need to get... Yeah, we need to put this in the locker quick. Oh, this is so bad. I just don't want to put anything on the floor anymore. I've literally lost... I've lost beer. I've lost kegs. I've lost so much through the floor and I have no idea why what's going on it's like being in tremors like the whole world is about to go kaput because I'm you know for some reason things have just disappeared I've even lost buckets like there's, there used to be a fermentation bucket there it's not there anymore I'm losing equipment in the floor this is how bad it's got and it's like I need to get through this I need to get through so I'm gonna skip this day we should be fine skip don't give a damn about the cut the the world we're just going to skip through the day, finish the mission. Don't care. All right, you've convinced me with this beer. Let me know when you'll need me. Excellent. So we should have our cook. Hey, Go into the tablet. Oh, and now he wants to talk to me again. Yes, Remember, Albert, the remember there are still many things that you can do to benefit your brief. Yeah, I know. Things that the philosophers never dreamt of. Never you, will dreamt of. Them you will surely discover them while running your business. Yeah, all right. That's all I've got cool. for you for now. You, so away. you basically just sense. found bloody tastic. Thank you very much, you stinking hippie. Right. I'm so annoyed right now. I, I need to buy something that's going to stop things falling on the floor. Like, this is it's so annoying because it's like, yeah, why is this happening? Okay, so I'm going to buy one of these for now. And it just means I've got another surface to put something on. But I'm, I, I want the racking for the actual uh, shelf because it actually looks pretty cool. But this, this is just, man, I, I've got, this is doing me in. I've got another one of these for now, but I will change them over at some point. Cool, right. So if I just buy a couple more fermentation buckets. Four of those, we got kegs, we need some hoses. I'm so pissed off. So I'm gonna leave so I'm gonna leave this stuff in my inventory just because I'm not gonna touch it for now. Uh, what I will be doing is I need I'm gonna I think even if I buy some beers it's gonna cost me money, but I know they're good. I know they're just going to work it. I have got, saying that, if I go into my beer section, one of these should be called the Homeless Mike. There it is, Homeless Mike. He's $164. So I'll get rid of all of these. Because I've been making, oh, this is all I've been doing. I've just been making like APAs forever. So I have got Homeless Mike here. I'm going to add him to the cart. I'm going to bring him in. So that's $20 of Homeless Mike, or 20 litres of Homeless Mike. So that's good. It at least means I've got a beer that I can put up onto the tap. And that's all right. So, Homeless Mike, you are being represented. Welcome to the beer. Because that's what you are now. You're a beer. You're a beer. You're a beer. All right, cool. So, we'll take Homeless Mike. We'll pop him up on there. I'm going to get my connection pipe. Stick that on there. Stick that on there. Homeless Mike, you're now on my tap. 
Welcome to the family. There you go. You're an I, you're an APA. So I've now got a cook. That's all good. Now what I need to do is I need to. Impl oh no! Now my tablet's schooled. Let me just exit out and then let's come back. Right. So homeless Mike's on tap, and that there goes another connection tube. All good. Excellent. All right. Cool. Yeah. Right. Staff. I can hire him for thirty dollars. Let's hire. You know, in the next video, what we're going to do is we're going to do this. Uh, what have I got left over here? Evidence that the guy sitting in front of you is an alien. Yeah, that's cool. All right. So yeah, we need to pay back our debt. I need to hire the chef. We need to do some cooking. I need to do some stuff. You know what? And I've, I've got some money we can decorate the bar with, which is going to be fine. I've got some stuff. I've got more stuff to buy. I'm going to buy some scenery stuff, get my bar back up to where I had it before, before I had to replay the game again. Let me just decorate. You know what? I'm going to bring in two arcade games into the bar as well. Because they're 20 bucks a piece. $20. I'm not sure how much money these things can make, but hey, it's passive income. I'm taking it. So. Oh, no. Do, no. Uh, yeah, but, yeah, there we go. Right. There we go. we got a mini arcade. Fantastic. We'll need some lights around that and be happy. So yeah, I should be get. I'll get a cook in for the next video. But now we've got tables. We've got arcade games. I haven't put any stools up around yet because I'm still sort of working out how to do stuff, which is just the way I am. But at the end of the day, you can see the, some of the problems I'm having. Like things are literally disappearing in front of me, through the floor, everywhere, through the shelving, and it's like, what the hell am I supposed to do? So I'm trying to be a bit more conservative about what I'm actually doing. But at the same time, we're still out here. I'm still enjoying the game. It's just, my God, this thing needs work. I'm going to borrow this. Uh, I'm going to have to put all this over here. I'm not sure what the mixing bowl is for. We haven't got around to experimenting with this yet. But I suppose we'll figure it out at some point. I'm going to move my shelf. I need this shelf. You know what? I'm going to put that shelf right there. Now we've got two shelves. Fantastic. And I'm going to bring this locker over here as well. Now I've got more workspace. Excellent. I have no idea what we're doing with all this though. It's a big room with not a lot going on. So yeah, um, now I've got like my fermentation buckets. So if I need to make any more, if I need to make any more beer, we can. We can do it at mass as well. It means I, I'm not limited to just making one beer at a time. I can now do five. That's another thing that's disappeared. My big cooking pot's gone as well. Holy crap! So I've lost my big cooking pot, several kegs, fermentation buckets, pint glasses. I have no idea where it's all going, but it's actually getting annoying. I've lost six glasses. I have only broken one of them, so I don't know where they are. I think we've got enough glasses for now. That'll do us. All right. Now I need my big cooking pot again. There we go. Now they're on solid surfaces, and hopefully they don't disappear. I have got all my connection tubes. I will get another rack in to put those on as well. But, it, yeah, it's, it's a little bit annoying. Just a little bit. On that note, it's all good. All right, guys, thank you very much for kicking by. This has been Hybrid Steel. If you have enjoyed this, hit the like, subscribe, and notification button below for all the other updates. I will be back here with a brand new video live stream or whatever else new on the channel. I will be playing this game a lot more, and I'm hoping the up updates come along and fix this because some of the things in this game are really, really annoying. But apart from that, it's all good. Until my next one, bye-bye for now.